it's regarding hatching again. Uh, the question. Uh, what uh, while uh, we are doing the warming after thawing, um, have you done any studies regarding what is the hatching percentage of blastocyst? How many percent of blastocysts do hatch? Do hatch? Yeah. So I think we conduct we conduct this experiments eight or nine years ago. So we we. We normally com com compare the about more than three. Because we have to have another an extra day of culture to see whether there is a point of hatching or it is hatching out. And I just com yeah. compare some hatching rates yeah. yeah. of the blastocyst or a vitrified blastocyst. Yeah, yeah. vitrified blastocyst. Yeah, so it was the same. Okay. So, I, so I decided to not doing uh, assist the hatching at that time. Excuse me. How many zygotes we can load on one? Uh, one So one I, I think the the. Minimum number of the zygote. Oh, oh, a minimum yes, number of the oocyte is three. Mm. Yeah, because our our ICSIAN culture system, if we have three oocytes, mm. we can have one embryo to, to be transported. No, on one now. One. The minimum one. and the maximum. One. Minimum. Mm. Uh, minimum and the maximum, which, which is only three. Because we, we never, uh, we cannot do <coughs> egg donation in Japan. So how many does one. one. The number of the all site embryo on one cryo tech is the number of the all site number of the all site embryos to be used after moving. So, so we do only in a single single chance. So only one does with this Yes. So day three embryos use uh three embryos or three embryos cell stage? Day three. Yeah. We don't do cells day three. Yeah, we do that Yes. I recommend you to, to make the brush is brush BT. Uh, you talk about survival, the, the uh, right tool, right protocol and uh, cell quality. So when we like oocytes, not all of them will be a uh, very good quality, suppose for You can embrace the quality of the oocytes uh, during equilibration. Okay. Yes. And if you, you watch the oocyte morphologically, it will be very clean and very clear, very good. But if it takes 40 minutes, 50 minutes, still shrink, it's very great. Uh, you can very clearly evaluate the quality by exploration step. So those oocytes, we are not going to... If the uh, oocyte recovered, what we recovered during warm, uh, during the exploration, mm -hmm. within 15 minutes, all survive. Okay. I've never seen that oocyte. And my question is, if I did want to put three blastocysts on one cryotech, um, then um, do I do three separate drops, or do I all on one drop? Yes, yes. One drop in one blastocyst in one drop, always. Okay. Yes. If you prefer five five blastocysts, you make five drops. Thank you. Okay, so. So the maximum yeah, is <laughs> if I freeze with. Any other media? I can talk with the, your media? Yes. What is the difference? Please? So, you know, so my, uh, my, my step, my solution, it's, uh, it's contained HPC, it's most of large exchange of the solution, means gradual exchange of the osmolality. It's very small, soft for all the blastocyst or embryos, or side to with any other method. So, I think so, you have many, many conversion results. You obtain better results. So when we when we use cryotech system, the vitrified by cryotech system. And if uh, one or two blastomeres are damaged, then you can count that it, it is a hundred percent survival rate, or that is in a damage. What you can tell? If it's an embryo you are going to freeze, and one blastomere is damaged, then how you can? The survival judgment, the judgment of the cleaved cleaved stage. Okay. So for example, eight, <coughs> if you have eight breast on yeah. okay, if three survive, yeah. this can be baby. Four. Okay? Then three over eight, two over four, one over two is a survival. I mean the whole side an embryo has value to be transferred <coughs> to get the baby. And one more thing. If I do a PGD, yes. then it is uh, six to eight cell that I can freeze or you you can make your blaster and then you can if I done the PG and six or seven embryos are normal, and I do not want to transfer all this embryo, one or two, then four embryos I have to freeze. Then how you change? 
So uh, I don't know. We in our case we vitrify. Uh, we the brushes. We take the brush, some uh, some cells out uh, and brushes the stage. Yes, I think some yeah, some, some cell. Yes, endotro endo uh, endotrophic cells and brushes the stage and vitrify. Huh? Then you can find abnormalities, so we discover it. <laughs> so I think so. Demo live demonstration answer you more. Okay. 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 That's that's it. And they don't want to take them to blastocyst stage. So do you suggest which you find at four cell or eight cell? Because what I've noticed, you've mentioned two pin oocyte, got four cell and blastocyst in your slides. For yeah, it's the same. So we should wait at four cell, or do you suggest we go to eight cell? Is there a difference? You know, survival rate is same. The negative effect to the by vitrification is same to the four cell, five cell, six cell, seven cell. It's all the same. And after we thaw, as we not go to blastocyst stage, we recommend transfer after one hour of incubation, right? Yeah. Okay. Yes. The earlier the better. After warming, the transfer the earlier the better. The area is better. You don't need to wait for one hour. The area is better. For clearing stage, you don't need to wait. For blaster stage, you should wait for one Yes, because we need, we need to uh, make a survival adjust for the blaster stage. That's why we need time uh, to the expansion of the blaster cavity to confirm the survival of the blaster stage. So we take time. I'm doing site cryopreservation. So my survival has been getting very good around ninety uh, percent. But after I do exit, the cleavage is like uh, most of them arrest at four cell. So is it uh, something with the oocyte quality or is it something with the... the protocol? You can improve the protocol. I think if you send them the only ninety percent for oocyte education, say it's, uh, fertilization rates, transmission rates decrease. But if you obtain ninety nine percent. The fertilization rate, scripts rate, process monitor rate, almost the same, almost the same to the fresh one. The ten percent difference is very important. It's evidence of damage is ten percent. So if you if you if we identify ten people, if you want, okay, it's damage. Okay. One of the ten that is very bad. Also, the surviving people is also have much damage. And you can improve. Okay. So the demonstrator is Dr. Kagawa. He has been my, is one of the, my, all the best students, and uh, now she's a new staff of my research center. And she, as, as you knew, so she first succeeded with education of ovarian tissue, and also GB oocyte. The first is very excellent. So. First, we show the oocyte. Today, we vitrify human oocyte. Okay, so you know the thickness of zona pellucider is about ten micrometer. Okay, so this is not ten. In average, this same, same, same. About mm, okay. You know the zona thickness of zona pellucider and peripetal space. Peripetal space is about fifty percent, half. Thickness of the zona pellucida. Okay, it is begin beginning. If once it shrink and recover, the peripetal space is become the fifty percent of zona zona pellucida. It is the end of this step. Okay, always it is very easy to uh, compare comparison uh, with the thickness of zona pellucida. There's a difference between here. This image and yes. that image is different. She said this is about very. We can evaluate the quality in equilibration step. Okay. Okay. Perimeter in space is almost the same. Average of the perimeter in space. Okay. Is same to the thickness of zona pellucida. Okay. Here. This contains three plates. Three vitrification plates. Yeah, fit for about for more than 20 oocytes for egg donation. Was three times for vitrification uh, for the, of the blast cyst, three plates. 
Yes. And one vial of equilibration solution and two vial of vitrification solution is fit for about three times, three times of the vitrification. So it's contain no serum, no protein. So we can store it in the room temperature. But it's better to uh, store in the fridge. So we can store for more, one year, one year last. So first we take one year, one year. And it should be room temperature. Then take the box, one hour. More than one hour before the use. Three strong. Okay. How many patients do you still want to keep? One kid, how much? One. Number of patients. The player. What is the one kid? The one kid to fit for one patient. Three times the patient. One kid for one patient. One patient. So, you give three vials, no? Three vials. Three vials. Yes. So we can we can vitrify in the morning of day five, in the evening of day five, and also day six. Three times for one patient. Oh, yeah. 